Welcome back to Armored Core, Master of Arena. We're going through the arena, and uh, yes, Operation Minefield is working, and it's beautiful, and I love it. <laughs> Ideal. What is he? He is a crabby mech, and he's got a big cannon on his back by the looks of it, and cannony arms. Fights for the love of the cold hard cash. The AC is gold plated. No, it's just painted yellow. That's not gold plated. And carries the emblem of a hammer. Mm -hmm. Okay. You want a challenge? Yes, we do. <laughs> the green mined up fields of death. I'm gonna that's gonna be my like home arena, I think. I think just off this off this minefield is like just a hut. And that's where I live. All right, he's moving quickly. I'm damn sure this is fucking Tekken free music. Like it's literally Tekken free music. Okay, he has pushed me off my hill. Ow! Fuck! Ow! Fuck! There we go. Get off me! Leave me alone! I'm not leaving the arena. Shit, get fucking get your sights down, you bastard. What? Oh, I left the fucking arena. Uh, yeah, let's try that again. Hi, Luke. Come sit with me. Good boy. Lose! <laughs> right. Try that again. Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, he is aggro as fuck. Okay, he's coming at me. Oh, he's got hit by a couple of mines. Right, let's let's get on the move. He will be killed by mines if we keep this up. Okay, this is my actual hill. I think I overshot and went to that hill last time. Let's move on to hill number three. Now, he's not going to be about a bit. I know that hill number three. Win! <laughs> I need not rush him. <laughs> I fucking love this map. The map does the work for me. I just need to not die. That's all I need. That's my only job in this. Let's view, let's view his, his camera. He's rushing me. Oh, he's got that missile launcher that I had on me. Before. So, cheap pussy tactics, yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, sorry, I'll rephrase that. Winning tactics. Winning. Yeah, so he's gonna, he's, we're gonna have a little, a little fight over, over this hill here. That's what you said. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna run away here and he's gonna die to some mines at some point here. So I've I've disappeared off into the sky. And he's walked into a bunch of mines. <laughs> Skill zero, cheese is all. Never did. I won. Lies. I never. I am absolutely the victor. So there you go. A few more to kill. Challenge Frogman. Lucky Hopper. Uh, designed his AC for to resemble a frog. His attacks incorporate many leaping maneuvers. Okay. He's got missiles. He's going to be jumping around, which suggests that he's not going to hit that many mines, so we might actually have to do a bit of damage now. Hmm. 
I've got like the mech equivalent of cruise control on. Like my my missiles fire themselves when they when they lock on. There we go. Oh shit! Okay, there he is. Okay, he's pushed me off my first hill. Second hill. It's here we are. Well practiced at this. But he is seemingly just gonna jump around. <laughs> Eat mines, bitch! Oh, there he is. Fucking hell. Right, he's off. He jumped, pushed me off my second hill. Off to the third hill. I might not make it. These uh, are slightly more powerful boosters than what I'm used to. Shit. Alright, let's um, keep moving. He will eventually hit some mines. Ow. Winning. <laughs> bye bye. I know this map. It is good. <laughs> I could try to have a proper fight with someone with someone, but I mean that increases the likelihood of losing. And most of these mechs have got, like, high damage output, which will just, like, rip me to shreds. This tactic was developed against, like, mechs that I, I literally physically couldn't beat face-to-face. -face. So, yeah, I had, I had to, I had to make a, a thing that worked. Okay, one against all of them. Uh, I need to challenge these lot. Meave, or Mauve, or however you want to say it. Also a member of the AC Team Fog. His hunting skills have been compared to those of an eagle. Eagle! <laughs> Save state, there you go. Let's crack on. Let's give him again. Let's see if I can crack a couple of shots off first. Before we boost away. Okay, it seems he's gonna follow me. Didn't make it behind the hill. And he is directly on top of me. Holy fuck. There is no escape. Oh my god, there is actually no escape. He can't, he's not letting me out. He is not letting me out of his sight. He can actually follow me quicker than I can run away. Shit. Oh, he's got a lot more missiles than I do. Bloody hell. There's some mines. Right, fuck you. Get off the fucking hill. Get. Shit. You're gonna hit some mines eventually. Don't lose, don't lose. Fuck. Well, that's me fucked. Where's he gone? Yeah, I'm just gonna, gonna hide behind this hill. Oh, my power, oh, my power's up now. That's good. Oh, 
Yeah, he's winning now. He is not leaving me a second to breathe. The winning tactic. He is negating my uh, my abilities. Oh shit. Alright, he's still winning. Sort of. Just about. Right, get behind the hill. And he is. He, he's just in the air constantly. I'm dead. Let's try that again. Good job, AI. Slap his cheese generator in the face. What abilities? Come on. Alright, fine. Give this another go. This time, let's be a little bit more... Sad cheese. Look it, I'm just gonna stand up on him. Oh, okay, he's just right behind me, the bastard. Come on, back up. He's right behind me, the wanker. Okay. And it seems he can stay in the air for fucking ever. Um. Ouch. Well, he hurt himself with that. There he is. What? Hit. Over, over compensated with the height there. He's got me. I don't think I can beat him with my current mech loadout. I really do have to just rely on him hitting mines. Ow. Yeah, he's got, he's got me now. I'm dead. Right behind the hill? Yes, I am. Thank fuck for that. Yeah, there he is, he's in the air. Oh, fuck off. No way did your fucking missiles hit me there. The only way I'm going to win this is if he hits a mine now. Otherwise I'm done. I know there's plenty of mines around this area. Oh, he's coming around the other side here. Done. Fuck. Okay. Continue. Yes, let's try that again. So my energy weapon is absolutely fucking useless against this guy because um, I'm not going to be able to hit him. So let's just keep moving. I start with more HP than him, and as long as I can drag him into some mines. He's knocked me off. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, he is fucking knocking the shit out of me here. He's not giving me a fucking second, an inch. He's got to hit the floor at some point, and when he does, that's, that's when my damage is done. just not hitting the floor. He is flying pretty much indefinitely by the, se by the seams of it. By the seams of it! 
Oh, well, that's me done. Yeah. By the seams of it. That's, that's English, apparently. Hmm. Okay. He is so aggro. My god. Yeah, the laser rifle does not hit. Oh my god. Okay, I need to somehow get a fucking lock on him. He's, he's knocking me out of the fucking battle arena right now. Okay. This is the only tactic I've got. Do ring around the roses. Shit. Hope he doesn't just like go full aggro on me again. Oh, I've got nothing. I've got nothing. I can't actually do this, I don't think. This mech isn't good enough. There's the mines, lovely stuff. Ooh, that's just giving me a fucking shot here. Oh my god, yeah, he's just aggroed hard. Right, let's get around the other side. He's on top of me. He's on top of me again. Shit, I'm dead. I'm dead. The only hope I've got is mines. Go through that mines. My mines, you've got to work for me. And he's done. He's got me. He's got an energy weapon, and I think that's what's um, kicking my ass because I don't have the energy weapon redu um, damage reduction yet. Might have to back out and do that. Okay, one more go at this with the current setup we've got. Oh, that's me done, I think. Nearly. Right, okay. This still worked for me earlier. But he did eventually get really aggro on me. I just need to keep the hill between us and start hitting him, but he's not letting me. The AI is fucking me right now. And having a great time doing it. I can't fucking, I can't get a bead on him. There's some missiles on him right there. I'm still technically not massively um, behind in terms of like AP. And there you go. I'm in the lead. Officially in the lead. Gotta keep the hill in between us. Keep the hill in between us. Don't let him fucking get that sword on you. Okay, let's go. Let's go somewhere else. Okay, here we go. I'm going on the. I'm going near the ground. Okay. Now he's just directly on top of me again. Trying to get a sword on me. Okay. 
He's getting his sword on me, and I'm dead. I, I can't run away from him. He's too quick. I've got nothing. I've got nothing. Well, yeah, hey, Serini, how's it going? Welcome in. Sultan Matari is, is definitely in the room right now. Right, let's back up. Let's see what else we can do. He's kicking my ass with his energy weapon. We we can negate that a little bit. Hmm. Okay. His pansy powers have dissipated. <laughs> Okay, he's just a bit... he was a bit quick. Ugh. Okay. Optional parts. Da, 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 da. Where am I? So jamming would be good, but I don't think I've got the... Uh, ...basty for that one. Um... Shortens lock on time, reduces damage from energy rounds. That's the one I want. Could get. Shortens lock on time. Maybe. Let's buy that one for now. You can be fast, but only build big and but you only build big and slow. I do like fast. I just uh, the legs won't carry me. <laughs> Right, what's the best legs for... I think I, I had them before. Um, it's these, isn't it? Yeah, not enough credits. Fuck. Um, shades on hard mode has been redeemed for the next... Well, I mean, when it, it gets redeemed for now. There you go. I'll do it for the, next, the whole next fight as well. Okay. Assembly. Um, what was I doing? That was the only optional parts that I that I had. Optional parts. Until you win the fight. <laughs> that may never happen. Okay. Well, I'm going into the fight a little bit. You know, more resistant to his. Uh, his attacks. But oh, my fucking god. It is. It's gonna be absolutely lethal. I don't have any defense against him because I can't get away from him. I do think I need to just go faster. Get faster mech. Do you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna sell the fat legs. I'm gonna sell the fat legs. I'm gonna put the uh, the other leg, the other legs back on. We do, we do need to be fat. We need to. Sorry, we need to be fast, not fat. Okay, legs. That's the one. Okay. Might need to lower the um, my arms a bit. This is going to over overweight me, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Okay, so I need to slim down by... 6, 7, 8, 9, 300. I need to slim down by 300. Only the ass needs to be fat. <laughs> Welcome in, my kids. How's it going? Slimming down. Uh, arms? I reckon we can slim that down a little bit. That, that's 1,000 weight. I think we can buy some arms which are 700 weight. Oh, there's some. Lightweight type arm units with better performance. That sounds good. Uh, 
That works for me. Take off the sword. You don't use it. I would use it if he got close if he got close enough and I could see him. At the moment he's right in my arsehole, and the sword doesn't really work there. Okay. Ah. Well that's that's very close. Brother, I am pinned here! No. I am pinned here! Welcome in, Stricken. Thank you so much for that. How the devil are you tonight? We are getting our asses handed to us. In the arena. Sure you could use the sword uh, from your ass. You just need to think outside the box. Shit! And yes, I could shit the sword. Just equip it in my anus. Right. Let's get to it. Might need to fit, change the arena because he's not getting he's not getting hit by the mines at all. Welcome to the salt show. <laughs> That's how we be. There we go. Right. We can actually escape him now, which is nice. Okay, I thought we could, but apparently we cannot. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, wow, yeah, no, he is ripping me to pieces. Sort of stand behind this rock. Oh fuck! No, that's me getting hit by my own medicine. Hmm. Maybe we change maps. Just here to give you views. Well, thank you very much, Stricken. Appreciate the lurk. Okay. Maybe we change the map. Hmm. Okay. Let's go somewhere where he can't just like boost up and kick my ass. Uh, there? Might be a good one. This is just gonna be a straight shooting match. He might win, because he's got a sword. Where's the cop? Is he outside the map? He's gone down an alleyway. Right behind fuck he's right behind me. Oh shit, I've got no boost. He's 
winning. Oh, that was close. That was close. I'm gonna try that again. This time, let's like actually be accurate. In a straight shooting match, I can win this. Trying to get near me. Where is he? Where's the fuck? There he is. He's just fucking strafing me. I can't. I can't keep up with him. Oh my god, Aim! He's in the hitbox, you fucking twat! Oh, uh, I can't, people. But yeah, I'm dead. Right, try fucking boosting to the right now, you bitch. I've got you cornered. Shit. He's still winning. Got him. Fucking hell. You get staggered a lot. Yes, I am. <laughs> and there you go. Shade time is up. Jeez. Need to install some stuff to like not be staggered so much, but I haven't got that many more points to put in. So I think the next thing I'm buying is going to be the thing that gives my energy weapons more damage. You've got new mail. Okay. Jeez, that was a that was a harsh one. An emergency situation has arisen. We have a request that needs your immediate attention. Please read the request description for more information. All right, we'll do that then. Uh, let's save at this stage because it seems like we've reached a plot point. Override that. I think we can do a couple of little tweaks on our mechs. On our mech, even. I only got one slot for, uh, for mechs in this one. And the, 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 the shop. Buy. Um, option parts? Uh, that's the thing I want eventually. That's the thing I want now. I can afford it. Nice. That should save ammo capacity. Should have enough part, uh, enough points to equip it. Yes. Literally one more left, and then I need a better core. Right. So I've got no energy beat and energy la um, blade. No sword. That's, that's apparently a sword motion. Um, mission. Emergency. Assist marine lab. Okay. So I'm going to do a quick save state here. Rog tech. An emergency situation has, been co has come up. We're sending a mission request well, uh, directly. Rogtech Marine Laboratory is under attack by an unknown MT. The attacker's objective is still unclear. We've already sent in another Raven, but he was unable to complete the mission. The best he could, uh, could do was stall the enemy's invasion of the facility. Dear me. An important company official is housed within the facility. It's vital that he be rescued and brought to safety. As is our right. As your sponsor, we are temporarily revoking your license to participate in the arena 
This mission is now your top priority. Bastards. Okay, gonna kill five MTs. This should be fine. It's only five little little robot things. This is where they're about fucking twelve stories high. Hmm. <laughs> Destroy all enemy forces and rescue our ally from the facility! Okay. System engaged. Yep. This seems fair, fairly uh, simple. A simple task. Okay. How could the Raven not do this? There are any little MTs. There we go. So friend. Hey dude. How's it going? Thanks. You arrived just on the nick of time. My ammo reserves just ran out. Well, that's why you don't have ammo reserves. Who is that? Huh? Maybe this fucker. Ooh, that's a fucking Eldar. Run away for a second. Ow. Okay. I have a plan. Where is he? There he is. Can the missiles not hit him? Hmm, probably not. Maybe I'm too close. Oh shit. Oh! Don't get hit. Yeah, we're not doing any damage here. Oh, that was bad. Let's load. Well, he's dead. This is the only way. Hang on, what's Richard saying here? You know there's a quick button for quick save and quick uh, and quick loads. I can't remember what it is. I'm too lazy to go look. You know where it is, and you want to tell me that I would I'd be much appreciated. Muchly appreciative. <laughs> Usually F5 and F7. Excellent, thank you very much. Very nice. Lovely stuff. We killed the giant thing. We had to cheese it a bit, but we killed it. 
Bear, are you choking on something? Where's Bear gone? Where's Bear? What are you doing, Bear? He's out, he's out in the hall doing something. What you doing? Come here. Oh, no. Other dog wants attention instead. Okay. Button will be worn out. <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's go to the mail. Okay, mysterious MT. Green screen's not working now. There you go. Hello, my name is Ellen Kubis. I'm the head of development at Progtech. Thank you for your assistance the other day. I believe the attack was directed at our research group. It's a relatively common occurrence in our business. There's one aspect about it that bothered me. Specifically, the MT that appeared from out of the water. It would be hard, given the current technology, to build an amphibious MT. I know of no group that has had success. It's possible the technology lost during the Great Destruction has been re rediscovered. I fear an unknown organization possessing advanced technologies may be involved. Hmm. Warning. Long Nielsen. As I explained earlier, I'm your Raven's Nest contact and the one who will supply you with your orders. You will follow orders you are given and do as I say. Even if approached by a sponsor, you are not to accept any missions without my approval. Don't let it happen again. We've been told off. All right, mom, bloody hell. Ugh. So unfair. Okay, uh, data save, we're gonna save. Shock horror, I know. You right there, Luke? Oh, he's so, he's so relaxed right now. Oh, he's a relaxed dog down there. Okay, let's go with this one, because it had the least amount of money in it. <sighs> Save completed. Lovely stuff. Okay. So, where were we? Uh, there are missions, I think. Yes! Bunch of missions. Destroy giant tank. Damn. But this is called Master of Arena, and I think we need to do the arena. Okay. So, ooh, Stunt Rider is an he's a new challenger. Funky Flyer. Um, a physicist who says he survives by calculating missile trajectories and avoiding them. Okay. I'm going to try the autosave. That did not work. Shit. Cancel. <laughs> that opened up a different menu. Uh. Um. File. Uh, how do you full screen again? Windows scale. Uh, full screen. There you go. Right there you go. <laughs> so, F5 and F7 are not the buttons, so I'm going to just press F1 and do the uh, the thing normally. Challenge, yes. Okay, we're going to go back to uh, the huge, I think. Chal the top. Chal the top. I have no idea what that means. Chal the top? Nope. 
Right. Operation Minefield. <laughs> Alright, he's pushed us off the first hill. So on to the second we go. Hey, this one's the one that's really fucking close to the uh, to the exit. Let's go to this one, to Hill 3, because we missed Hill 2. Excellent. Challenge. F2 save, F4 load, my bad, no worries. Oh, you're thinking of the Sierra games. That's fair enough. Different emulator, different times. He's flying around. Oh, there he is. Come on, then. He's trying to hit me. Um, I think he's just shooting the, the, the hill. I don't know what kind of weapon he's trying to hit me with, but he's, he's definitely hitting the hill. I think he had one of those stationary weapons where you have to, like, deploy it so you can't actually move. And he was banking on me going to, like, look at him, but I didn't. I just shot him over the hill, and it worked, and it's good. Nice. That's how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. That is how it is done. Right. So, what are we on? Another 10,000 acquired. And uh, is that a head? Or is it a weapon? Might be a weapon. We'll check it out in a bit. We have got quite a few little parts, haven't we? Um, Flash, Lightmaker, believes that a victory should be achieved with style and class. Prefers fancy weapons. Well... I think me and Flash have got very different ideas on victory. Flashlight maker. <laughs> well, I've got the I've got the correct emblem to penetrate his uh, his flashlight. We bye bye. <laughs> right, there we go. A practiced maneuver right there. Okay, where's he gonna come from? I think I just saw him over there. Yes, yes I did. Right, he's got some sort of uh, energy weapon over there. He seems to be trying to flank me on the right. Mm. Oh, fuck, he's got some sort of artillery. Alright. I'll stand well behind the hill then. Here he comes. Advantage Buller. I can do this all day, pal. <laughs> Was that a mine you just hit, was it, buddy? Oh, all right, I've been pushed off. Hill two. He's gonna push me off this one very quickly, I think. Yeah, let's go straight to hill three. Don't even worry about it. Ooh, that weapon he's, he's hitting me with is fucking powerful. He seems to... Uh, be full of rage and anger. Oh yeah, he's got a static weapon. I will just keep hitting you. Oh, he's just out of my missile range. Oh, there he goes. Oh, 
I wonder if he's out of ammo. Well, I know I am. Fucking hell. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely my home turf. I know the hills. I know the mines. Now I can come over and just finish them off with a pew, pew, pew. Yeah. There you go. That's how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. Happy days. Bum, 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 bum. Another hundred ten k. Ooh, that's a head right there. That looks very nice. Okay, superb hunter. Crab mech, an AC pilot, a combination that takes advantage of speed over all else. We hate that. We hate that. Speed over all else, I hate that so much. Which means he's gonna be aggro straight in my face. What happened to all the mechs that were, like, you know, happy to just, like, chill behind me? Okay, yeah, he's coming directly after me. Right, straight to hill two. Whoa, king hell, he's right on top of me. Alright, let's just try and get him in a minefield. Fuck off, there's a fly right on top of me. Go fly. Oh, there's a fly right on me, and he's just doing my head in. He's just buzzing around me. And this little fuck is doing exactly the same thing. I can't do anything about it either, which is fucking annoying. This fly is fucking doing my head in. As is this mech. He's not getting hit by any of my stuff. Alright, it looks like he might have run out of ammo. Nope. There you go, there's the fucking mines working. Ow, wanker. Fuck you then. Oh, what? You could go too high? Oh, motherfucker. Didn't know that. Didn't know you could go too high. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, he will just be on top of me. Take a little respite. Okay, there we go. He's giving us a teeny weeny bit of respite. If we get a few missiles on him, he might decide to back up a bit. No, nope, he's he's straight on us. Still directly on us. Not gonna get a chance to turn and hit him. He's really on our arseholes here. Oh. oh shit, well that's me fucked. to uh, entering orbit. Right. Fucking moth. Fuck off. It's a moth. Or a bug or something. It's just fluttering around me like a fucking cunt. It's attracted to the light, I think. 
That was an actually uh, pretty intense battle, that one. Yeah. Couldn't cheese that. Ah! Down the team. Uh, ooh. Before it went cold. All right. Armadillo. I'm going to try the buttons just to see what happens. Just save just in case. Prides himself on his ironclad defense capabilities. <laughs> Ooh, this guy's gonna be slow. That's gonna play right into my hands. Yes! F2 is the button. Thank you, Rich. He's gonna run over so many mines, it's gonna be beautiful. It's gonna be beautiful. Can't wait. Bye! Bye, bitch! Right, here we go. Hill number one. Might only need hill number one, with the guy being so slow. <coughs> Oof. A big artillery weapon. Wow, okay, the, the big artillery weapon actually hits me even through the hill. There you go, I've got a nice uh, bit of cover now. Yeah, that defense isn't doing much good for you now, is it, buddy? Wait till you well, wait till you run over a mine. Just wait. It's gonna be it's gonna be really fun. About to run out of missiles. That's a concern. Well, there's my there's my missiles gone. All right. Well, at the end it was a bit tight, but uh. We managed to loosen him up. Damn, my health went, went down real low. I mean, I could have just cheesed it and, like, ran away and made him, like, walk over a bunch of mines, but... I knew I had enough HP to, to tank him. I didn't think he'd get me that low, to be fair. <laughs> like, be below 2,000 was, uh... A bit surprising. Alright, so this is only like the first arena. There's the X arena. The EX arena. There's the ranked. The ranked arena. But you have to change discs to, to enter them. I'm wondering if the uh, changing discs actually uh, allows you to load saves. I'm hoping so. I'm hoping so. Okay, shop. Yeah, we're gonna buy. Uh, oh, hang on, let's have a look at the head that I got. I want to see what that does. It was definitely a head, wasn't it? Yes. So I've got detailed computer. I've got uh, uh, area memory. Got noise canceller, biosensor, none, but that's fine. I've got the radar. That's a good head. I'm gonna use it. Uh, it doesn't have quite as much AC. Not have quite as much AP, but it's uh, it's got the radar. And that's the main thing I wanted from it. Uh, which means I don't need the radar on the back. Which means I can buy potentially <clears throat> back weapon. I can buy a second one of the missile pods I've got. Um, where are we? That's the one. Nice. Might not be able to fit it. It might be too heavy. Let's have a go. It's a back weapon. 
It is too heavy. I wonder if we can get an, am uh, an ammo box. Hmm. Oh, we've got two of them. Okay. Um, hang on. So each one of these is 755. So if I can find a missile pod that has 120 and 830, like a double one, that's like less than 1400. About a thousand, maybe? That'd work. I think the double ones are right at the bottom. Underneath the radars. There we go. So... 60, not 120. That's not great. Damage is good, though. Although it is also very, very heavy. That's got the same weight. Oh, it's very expensive, that's why. <laughs> ah, I see. Yeah, no, I want the ammo. Okay, I guess we're buying the le the uh, the chunky legs back then. Buy the big chunk legs. Ah, not enough credits. Okay. Uh, so, what legs I've got? Okay, bye. Legs. Big chunk. Nice. Okay. Um, what does that leave me with? 15, 7, 5, 4. Okay. Arms? Is there, like, really nice arms? I want the, the, the fat arms that aren't those arms. I think those are good. What is increased for added durability? I think that's the ones I want. Can I afford it with 15 plus? Right, just if selling the arms I've got gives me. It does actually, nice. Okay, sell that. Bye! Arms. Big fatty arms. Ooh, where are they? There. Good shit. Lovely. So I'm gonna be a big fatty, fatty boom boom again. Assembly. Okay, arm weapon, Q, arm weapon, Q, back weapon, back weapon. We've actually got ro uh, room to get even fatter if we want. We could have like, a fat core if we wanted. We've got the money for that. I don't know. Let's see. Do we have the money for the core? So, that's the really, like, really big one. And electronic warfare called mini slots for special equipment. Excellent shoulder load and heavy armor. I think that's the one I want. Uh, 7200. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that with the uh, money I've got. I could sell the old head. Yeah, sell the old head. Um, I would have enough money. I would have enough. Alright then. Go fatty. Let's get the cock and balls. Oh. Got our big balls on the back. Nice. Okay, uh, has it unequipped all of our optional parts? Yes, it has. Of course, it fucking has. Boom. Nice. Okay. 
Hold on. Oh, we have a batter mech. May or may not be a good idea. Let's have a look at the arena. If we can get all of this arena stuff done, I'll be very happy. Hip Hiptismo. Haunted. Uses both automatic and single fire weapons. He never gives his opponent a chance to get warmed up. That sounds like he's going to be all over me. Let's give it a go. Oh, the dog is being very cute right now. You can't see it because he's below the uh, the camera, but he's just like he, he he's fallen asleep watching me, and he's just like. All right, here we go. Righty then. Ow. Wanker. Oh, he's hit the mines. Oh, he's coming for me. I believe this is the hill. Excellent. Good flying me. There's some uh, mines he's just hit. Lovely stuff. <laughs> Operation Minefield was a great success. Big fat mech is working for me. It's good. It's good. I'm sorry, Luke. Did I wake you up a little bit there? Oh, he's cute. My Borat impression was a bit too much for you, was it? Oh, terrible. Okay. Nice. Next. <laughs> Only three more to do here. Excellent. LD. Weasen Tail. This is pilot mounted his weapons uh, on four legged base and painted it red to resemble a scorpion. Yeah, you know, it is a scorpion. Looks more a bit a bit like a lobster at first, but then you realise it's got a tail. Like a spiky tail. Yes, let's challenge this bad lad. So yes, Arena Layer 1 is nearly done. Operation Cheese Mine. Working great for us. Alrighty then. Enjoy those mines, sir. <laughs> oh, that was nice. That was nice. Excellent. Two more to go. We've had to, like change our tactics a couple of times but it's getting back like it's starting to spawn heavier mechs at me which means that it's starting to work really well mm. yes okay sweet devil mm. who's this uh evil kiss is the mech Unrelent, uh, unrelentless in his attacks, so he's going to be coming at me hard. He's a little bit slower than usual, though. He looks a bit like um, Optimus Prime, doesn't he, with the legs? By the time he closes in on his opponent, it's all over, apparently. Close in on this dick.
That's what we're going to say to him. And the bears being in the uh, in the hall. Ow! Oh fuck! That actually really fucking hurt. You've hit me into mines. That's my fucking job. Right, where's he going? I don't see him going left. Is he going right? Ah, there he is. Don't hit me, bitch. I'm trying to go left. Come on, then. Come a little bit closer, I dare you. I think what I'll do is I'll just back up a bit. Give him a false sense of security. Okay. Where's he gone? Oh shit, he's trapped. He's flanked me. He's flanked me right. Cheeky bastard. Cheeky bastard. He's in the trees, man. I'm not seeing the mines go off, so either he's already triggered them or he's uh, skillfully avoiding them. I think he's going around to the left now. No, nope, he's coming back. Come on. Right, I'm gonna abandon this hill and try and get him to uh, try and encourage him onto more mines. Bonk. There we go. Hill two. Gonna come after me. Ah, I see him. Oh, here he comes, here he comes. He's trying to shoot me. But he can't get me over the hill. He can't get me. Oh, he's on the left, I see him. He's got the range on me, that's the thing. The only thing that's keeping me alive is this hill. Oh shit, it's flanked. There he is. And the tents on this one. I can't even, I can't even aim at him. But see, I kind of, I can kind of see where he is, but I need a longer range uh, FCS. I think I'm gonna back up, like right to the back of the map. See if he can, uh, if he fancies coming a bit closer. There he is. Oh, shit, yeah, he's hitting me there. Not fancy, uh... Oh, he's hit me. Alright, I'm gonna try and encourage him onto some uh, more mines over here. Let's go to the corner of the map. For someone who's supposed to be, like, closing me down, he is a surprisingly long-range opposition. Where is he? Shit, he's on the left, I think. I didn't actually see where he got me from there. I don't know where he is. Ah, oh, there he is, little fuck. Right, now we're hitting you. This pressure might push him onto mines as well. Definitely taking his health down. Yeah, I think we've won this now. Oh, 
Oh, he's gone just up my range. There's the mines. <laughs> okay. So, we have had a redeem from Markuts. Describe a poot. Let us describe a poot. A fart. Whilst we watch from his view of tense battle. Okay. The Wawa fart. <clears throat> this is not a baby fart. The Wawa is an electrical gadget worked by a guitar player's foot that makes an electric guitar make weird Wawa sounds. Not all people would call this sound musical. There you go. Didn't say how rare it was. I'm assuming very. There we go. Ooh, I think that is all but one. Ninja! Ninja! Behind the simple cutesy emblem hides an aggressive AC pilot. Combination with the firepower to prove it. Alright. Let's give them a go. I changed my love. Right, let's kick some ass. Let's see if we can uh, make it rain mines. Let's go full screen for this battle. Oh, oh. There we go. Bye bye. Okay. They're closing on on me. Shit. There's some mines. Right, I'm off to my next hill. Don't mind me. Need to re regen. <laughs> and she bumped into some mines. <laughs> Lovely stuff. And that is the first layer of Arena complete. Yeah. Very nice. Clever. Ah, <laughs> oh, cowardly, some might say. Clever of us. That was very generous of you, Markets. <laughs> okay, I think we've done all of them now. Lovely. Now, I need, to, I need a disc change to get the EX Arena and the Ranker thing, but there is also missions to be done. Jesus hell! Yeah it is, Haste. Yeah it is. Let's save at this point. We've gone like half an hour without saving. I'm amazed. We should probably do some missions. I think. This mech is working well for us. I think that there, there is improvements we can make. Like, I think the generator could do with more. There is the um, optional part that we can buy for the extra, like, capacity. I think I'm going to try grabbing that. I've also got the um, the better energy weapon as well. Uh, capacitors in the generator. See, that's nice. Buy part, yes. Uh, buy the arm weapon, the better energy rifle. Wherever that's gone. There it is. Not enough credits. Okay. We'll save up for that. That's kind of our end goal mission. Okay, garage, let's just plug the improvement in. I think that's going to be fine. Only one more slot available there. Mm. 
Yeah. The copper ball mech is working well. Uh, let's do a mission before we finish up today, I think. What should we do? Defend submarine, destroy cannon? Enemy fortress? Board spaceship? Destroy giant tank? I mean, by the looks of it, all of the missions sort of stay here. and we, uh, They only disappear when, you know, we are asked to do an emergency thing and they come back, so... Traps should be more common in games. You notice you play uh, Valheim. One game that would be amazing with some trap mechanics. I think it does have some traps in some of the dungeons. Um, like there's holes in the floor in the Mistlands dungeons, and there's like there's eggs in the ceiling that will hatch and drop and drop enemies down on you. I think it would be unfair to say that there's absolutely no um, traps in Valheim. But yeah, maybe more would be good. But they are still they are still updating that game, so. They might. Right, I'm gonna I'm going to move myself over here, I think. There we go. Just so you can see more of the screen. There we go. Being able to design and set up traps of your own. Oh right, I see. Yeah. The only thing you really got is spike traps. Yeah. You can point them at uh, yeah, in front of doors. It would it works well. Your objective is to escort a marine transport battalion. You will board an RG Industries transport submarine and accompany it to its destination. Uh, RG Industries have become a target of recent terrorist attack activities. We believe that another attack on the company is imminent. We have no way to predict what problems might occur en route, therefore be prepared to handle any circumstances that may arise. Please don't be flying buzzards around. I can't be fucked with that. That's a not. That would be a bad time. Escort submarine. All right. I'm just doing a quick save state here, and then uh, if we don't like this mission, we can back out. You'd also move the screen over to the right a little as well. Um, I could do, I suppose, or I won't. I like I like it being a little bit overlapped. It's nice. Unidentified units detected behind us. Behind us. Enemy battle cruiser detected on intercept course. Oh, be careful. It's a ship. All right, cool. Our submarine cannot submerge due to engine failure. Please take care of all hostile forces while we make repairs. Very well. I shall. System engaging combat mode. Your AC will be impossible to recover should it fall into the ocean. Avoid the situation at all costs. So what we what we get shot by? Oh fucking assholes! That's why. Oh, I hate! I fucking hate aerial mission. Aerial enemies. Oh. Mission failed. System switched. To oh, normal mode. bollocks. Yeah. And I just hit the save state button rather than uh, load state, so I'm going to have to load properly from the memory card. Fuck. Right, note to self, we're not doing that mission. That mission fucking blows ass. Uh, where is the thing? There it is. You're not going to eat eat that, are you? No. No, I'm not. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I believe it's that one. I think. We did save just after we uh, did the thingy majig. The thingy majig. Fucking hell, bullet. Use your brain, you massive bellet. 
Um, yes. After we uh, we finished this arena, we did save. Hoping this is the right one. Uh, no, it's not. No, that's mail. That's mail, and it's not letting me back out. Let's load the other save. Get a load. That one. Load the save data, yes. Dun, 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 dun. I wish it like had arena wins on the on the save. Yeah, there you go. Right, let's do a different mission, because that one fucking blew ass. Uh, destroy cannon. Can do. The requester is, is Izumo Materials. We've recovered information indicating that a colossal cannon built during the Great Destruction is in the process of being restored. Verify this information, and if the reports we've rec uh, re received turn out to be true, destroy the cannon before the restoration can be completed. Izumo uh, Materials, whose emphasis is space development, has plans to launch a satellite. The cannons, the cannon is apparently set to target this satellite. The restoration of the cannon is indeed underway. Explosive charges must be set. And the cannon destroyed completely. All right, yeah. Let's kick some ass. Yes. Launch. The Borean High Highland. Extinct volcano. We've arrived at the combat area. We'll leave as soon as your AC is deployed. Okay. Main system engaging combat mode. We energy transfer to the cannon has been detected. It looks like they'll be firing soon. Set all four bombs. More fucking helicopters. You know what? Let's just fucking to uh, plant the bombs. Bomb planted. I mean, I'm just going to ignore the damage incoming. I, I can tank it. Oop, that's not the way. Oh! Do I'm a big tanky mech. I can handle this. This is fine. This is fine. The damage is barely noticeable. Even though I'm getting fucking rimmed. Oh. There we go. Do, 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 do. Oh no, I'm below 9,000. I'm under 9,000! I think somebody just, like, rammed me. There we go. Reflate. I should probably disappear then. Unidentified unit approaching. Probably oh, okay. Alright, I'll go into the I'll go to the ground there. Who's this prick? You're pretty strong, but this is where it ends. Alright. 
Oh, there you are. I see. Him. Verified as tollkeeper, a member of the Sabrina. There he is. We can't pick you up while he's around. Destroy him within the given time limit. Where'd he go? Not really. Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, I wish these fucking enemies would leave flying enemies would fuck off. Where'd he go? Not really, where'd he go? Not really, where is he? Not really, where is he? That might be him behind here. Yeah, that's him. There you go. Fuck you. Looks like you made it. We're coming in to retrieve you now. Okay. Please, please kill the, the buzzards that are annoying me. <laughs> Target of operation clear. System switched to normal mode. Yeah. Flying enemy, flying little tanky enemies are just a pain in the ass, and I refuse to, I refuse to engage with them. <laughs> That's like half the money though gone for the mission. But they're just annoying. I don't like them. Don't like them. Got new mail. Let's read that shit. Here is a request from your sponsor. Please read the mission description carefully. It appears that your skill and rating as a raven have increased. It's just a matter of time before you'll be allowed to enter the arena. The proper arena, not the pretend arena. Sweet, okay. We've got a request from them. So that'll probably knock all other missions off. Yep. That one. Alright then. We're gonna save. Because we've done our allotted three hours for the night. And uh, I think that's where we should call it. Let me save this. I think the top save was the oldest one. Yes. There you go. It's done. Lovely stuff. Right. So, that's us for the night. So I'm just going to say a big, uh, a big thank you. Oh, hang on, to everyone who's been here tonight. Um, thank you in particular to the following individuals. Um, thank you to uh, Serene and Stricken for put, making me put the shades on. <laughs> the Mark Hoots for making me describe some poots. For Rich for being here, man. We've missed you on Twitch. Um, and uh, obviously to Fraggle for the modding. Uh, we will be back. Probably going to take a night off tomorrow. But I really want to come back and do more of this. Might do tomorrow. But Thursday, we're going to do some Elite Dangerous. There's a big patch coming, and I'm not sure what the, uh, the changes are going to be. So Elite Dangerous night is Thursday. Saturday, you've done bugger all and, uh, anywhere recently. <laughs> yeah. Um, yes, sorry, what was I saying? Yes, Saturday is going to be our second Let's Play. And I believe it's also going to be mech-related. We're having a very mechy time. I'm going to be playing this bad lad, I think. Mech Assault 2. We did Mech Assault 1 some time ago. Might as well do the second one, eh? Um, and then on Sunday is Battletech Night. So, uh, yes. Um, hopefully... You've enjoyed yourselves. If you did enjoy yourself and you're not currently following, please hit that follow button. Everything we do here goes over onto the YouTube. And yes, you want to if you want to help us out, you can kick us a few quid of on coffee. Right, I think that's all the shouts done. Have a fantastic night, everyone. I'll see you next time. We're gonna see if we can raid someone. <laughs>